Hello again, everyone. I'm Nesbitt. You're the people of Skyrim. Looks like I need to update my EMV series. This has been another update. I'll do that later. Okay, so we re return to um, part two of Helgen Reborn. And we're going to continue with the uh, test of this uh, quest questing mod. <laughs> I see someone's already um, made a comment in the poll. <laughs> it won't. <laughs> I don't think it will either. <laughs> Let's just, it's very loud. Let's just, I just want to open up the poll, folks, so I can see it as we go through the day. Or through, sorry, through the stream. <laughs> that made me laugh. <laughs> I can see the poll now and, and your comments. So um, let's get back in game. That's funny. <laughs> I made it another 10 years. I thought we might see it, you know, within 10 years, but I don't think we will because um, we got Starfield, haven't we? And that's going to absorb at least 10 years of, of um, Beth said's time and, and our time. So <laughs> probably not. <laughs> Hi, Nat. <laughs> Maybe. Do you, you think it'd be before or is that a typo? Did you mean after? Do you mean 2036? But either way, I mean, <laughs> 20, if it's 2026, I don't think so. <laughs> but you never know. I mean, cool. If you get that one right, that's a hell of a shout. <laughs> they could be making it in secret, I, I guess. They could be, you know. You never know. I mean, that would be a big surprise, wouldn't it? Hello, NATO. Lovely to see you. Good to see you, guys. Okay, right. Um, we're training these new recruits in... Um, Helgen Reborn. So far, we've had no major issues with Helgen at all, except for one thing. When we are starting the beginning of the quest, well, this animated door in Helgen, in the keep, the NPCs couldn't access it. Wouldn't, it wouldn't open for them, so they didn't come through to the hall. It's very loud with that rain. They didn't come through to the hall to access the trigger to advance the quest where Val talks. So I picked up on that. And there's some little nav mesh issues as well. So I will do an individual patch for Helgen Reborn for people that don't use the um, TPS2 mod pack down the line. But there will be an all-in-one fix as well and an all-in-one patch for the mod pack. I'm just going to turn down the rain because it's really loud in relation to the talking in that. So I'm just going to go to system. Um, what am I doing, folks? Settings, audio. I suppose it's effect. Is it effects? I think it's effects, isn't it? Let's just turn that down a bit because that's really loud. Ah, that's a bit better. Okay, so. Just save. And let's continue this quest. Where's he to? Giotto. Let's go get Giotto. And let's train him up. There. Is that him, I think? No, that's not. Where is he? Ah, here he is, okay. Ah, he's the cat, okay. And I'm using um, the Dragonborn voiceover mod, of course, so there will be, you know, um, in terms of other, other mods, you're not going to hear his voice, okay, because he hasn't been patched for Helgen Reborn and stuff like that. Oh, and another thing I found out yesterday, folks. Oh, yes, Jodo comes. Don't try to force the dialogue. But where are we going? Okay. If you're using the Dragonborn voiceover mod, let the spacing happen or th some of the dialogues with some of the NPCs for some quest mods don't advance so okay I found that out the other day foul vermin have no honor they will die a shameful death by the blade of Giotto you shall see okay so don't forget to uh, if, well, if you want to that is hit that pole let me know what you think and um, hit the like button if you like the stream what time of day is it Okay, let's, uh, you can see okay in the stream, there seems to be a fair bit of light. I really love Splashes of Storms by, um, by, um, Power of Three. I really like that. It's a re really nice touch of those splashes kicking up like that, especially with this heavy rain. Um, so yeah. Let's go then, where are we going? That's not what I want, I want the map. 
All right. There's the Zeneca portal. To our heart. I guess really we... Let's fast travel to the Guardian Stones. Thanks for the lights, folks. I appreciate it. Um, so, yeah. And, of course, we've got Dragonborn loaded in as well. The Dragonborn uh, mod, so, which is a brilliant mod. I haven't played it for ages. Been too busy with my work. I am going to go through... Oh, oh, oh there's a dragon. we got a dragon. Let's uh, see where he's going. Where is he? I've lost him. Let's get up the top here, and he's more likely to... I hope you can see okay. We've got Minty's lighting kicking off. If you can't um, see a good well enough in the stream, folks, let me know, and I'll, I'll go through. I'll try to brighten... I'll just... Oh, there he is. Oh, shit, he's attacking there. I'll try to lighten it up for you in the EMB preset. Where is he? I'm hoping... I'm trying to get him to land if I can. And I am going to take him out with my sword with one hit, just so I can get on with the main Dragonborn questline, and then I'll revert to a... And uh, there he is. Then I'll revert to a normal sword. Oh god, I can't even see him. Oh, here we go. We got him. It's very dark. <laughs> Lovely. But nice effects in the background. Off of Lux via there. In um, the, the the the. Sorry, I'm getting excited. Um, Lovely light. Lovely, lovely. Let's bring up a torch. It's a dark night. Rainy, stormy. Some nice effects there. Lovely. I have got to sort out the skin for the dragon for this mod pack. As you can see, it's a bit... I think I've got two mods. Um, I think I've got to sort out my overwrite. That doesn't quite feel right to me. Um, okay, let's go through to the morning. So you can all see, all right? Let's just go through to the morning. Um, and so far, in terms of issues, we haven't had any major issues. Um, nothing that's going to take a lot of work to fix up, guys. All right, girls. So, um... Yeah. So, so far, so good. As you can see on that dragon, look. That's a pretty intense start to the game. All that thunder and lightning in the background and me trying to talk over it. <laughs> that dragon bones need sorting out. Okay, so. Um, like I said, we've got a lot of different mods we're running. And I'll uh, show you the full mod list when it's uh, totally complete for both Vortex and... Uh, oh, look at, the, look at that water. That's lovely. Did I pick up my... I have picked up my bow. Okay. So, um, so we've got a lot of Ryan's mods as well. Now, do you remember yesterday in the stream, um... R Ryan's, um, Lady Stone was conflicting with the TPOS2, um, NPC in his tents that are by the Lady Stone. Now, I've just... Just... For the hell of it, I was going to patch straight away. Keep Ryan's um, mod below TPS2 uh, AE. But I thought I'd just stick it above um, and see what we get. So I moved his all-in-one dragon... Um, sorry. Um, uh, standing Stones mod um, above TPS2 in the load order. And I just want to see how it pans out. Hopefully, you know, I'm not causing any major issues. Um, I might need to start a new game, but I'm going to have to do that soon anyway. Because as I make the all-in-one patch and as I edit the nav mesh um, corrections in certain areas where there's key nav mesh conflicts, I'm going to have to start a new game anyway. So, um, But what I don't want to do right now is undermine the legacy of the drag. Sorry, not legacy of the Dragonborn. Um, sorry, Helgen Reborn uh, test that we're doing. Although I am doing a vanilla test as well because... It isn't a true test when I'm streaming like this. I do local testing, folks, as well as the tests and streams. So I've got two different gauges. See how the mod Helgen Reborn uh, works with lots of other mods. And obviously see how it works with just, you know, Helgen Reborn um, and TPOS um, 2 AE. So I do various tests. I just don't do these streaming tests. Like I said, it's a lot of time. It takes a lot of time. Um, but again, you know... As you saw with all the previous streams of TPOSC, when we got to the end of it, after about 60, 70 hours in, once I got my OBS settings sorted out, we had no issues. There's no CDTs. There was nothing of note. And that's why it's worth it. Um, and again, I got proof of concept, and I can show people those streams and those playthroughs. And I'm sure somewhere, you know, no mods, no more packs are going to be 100% perfect. There's always room for improvements. 
But, um, you know, I can sort of say, hand on heart, you know, it's a good mod pack, it's been well made. There might be the odd thing I've missed, but it's well made. And it's going to be the same for this mod pack as well. Um, that's then occurred, just, you know, if you don't know, folks, that's the player home. And it's all quest related later on down the line. Ah, this looks better. So it was, now, I don't, I'm not quite sure about Ryan's standing stones. Actually, no, it still needs work. So it's going to need a patch for my sure. Money is on the big one. Okay, so we're going to, we are going to need a patch because my entrance, I'm, I would have to start a new game, I think. The entrance to Zenekur, there's generally a Dwemer Tower, right, in the water. And Ryan's Standing Stones, or something, I think it's Ryan's Standing Stones, quite sure, has overwritten the cell um, that has the Dwemer lift in the water that lets you get to Zenekur. We covered this in yesterday's stream, so I'm not going to go on about that now. So a patch is going to definitely be required. Let's go and eliminate this warlock threat, okay? So now we're going to eliminate this warlock threat. And we're going to focus and stay focused on Helgen Reborn. Let's get on with it. And again, I appreciate the time you're sharing with me. Um, it helps my channel grow. And I appreciate the likes and your input. Guys and girls, really appreciate it. So, um, yeah. You know, time's a precious res resource, as we all know. Now, am I actually going into this fort? I must be. I think I am, actually, if I remember correctly. I love these... Um, I love this. I love this hatch door. This is fantastic. I'm not sure, but I think this uh, is Fusher's work. Or I say Fusher, but I don't think that's correct. It's Fusher's um, 22X. I've got his all in one loaded in this mod pack. Lovely door, that. And the textures of the um, castle are fantastic. Really nice. I can see you, the quality, and it's not bad, actually. Let's um, stop... Uh, yeah, let's get on with it. Okay. Take a breath now. And you are pretty much right up with me, folks. Um, well, look at this. Hmm. Oh, I wonder... Have I got my shout? I have, haven't I, I think? Oh, I've got... Um, I just want to check something out, folks. Um, oh, I didn't load it for this. That's, oh, that was for... JS is... Um, Knapsacks look very nice. Look at the quality of that. Wonderful. Wonderful. Okay. Let's bring in a torch. Check in the light on the water and everything else. Okay. And then let's check some magic in relation to the interior. More checks again. Or, and we're using the e and preset setting suns. I'm sure most of you know that by now that follow my work. But again, I repeat myself for other people that may come along. You know, that's never seen my stuff before. That looks nice as well. That lights up the, the interior very nicely. Okay. And again, I must shout out, actually. I must uh, give a big shout out to um, Fireman. Um, again, that allowed me to use his... Re-engage as a base for my EMB preset, okay? So he allowed me to use his preset as, as, as you know, the um, the platform from which I built my EMB on. So that was really good of him. Um, I, I give him credits, obviously, uh, on, on on the Setting Suns EMB preset web page, um, mod page, sorry, Nexus mod page. But I just wanted to shout out for that because I don't do that too often. So anyway, let's um, let's just get into some stealth mode. Wait for that candle light. Let's get on with this. But yeah, just wait for that candle. That's better. Okay, right. No point sneaking around, I suppose, if I've got a bloody great big candle light going on. Don't think I need to worry about anything right now. I love those drops that are um, falling. Um, in you know when I'm in third person mode. Look at that. Look. I loaded up. Um, realistic water um, raindrops for EMB and that's had a, a nice effect uh, look at that lot. What's, what have I done differently that's a little bit different from what I normally witness what's going on there I don't know I'm not sure what to think about that that's the first time I've seen this folks these water drops that have fallen in front of my face that's a nice touch they're a bit big maybe that's what I'm thinking those water drops are a bit big just a little bit big maybe for my liking 
need to reduce them a little bit. I expect I can do that easy enough. Now let's move on. There's some, we're getting some nice interior effects. Nice lighting. Again, big up um, Lux, because I love Lux and the Lux series. That's why I worked so damn hard to make it compatible with everything. Oh, and XD Embers as well. The latest file update. Lovely. Very nice. Where's my guy? Yeah, he's with me. Okay, let's do this. Again, I'm going to use my cheat weapons just to move through the quest a bit, you know, with some pace. Okay. Again, if you don't know my work, folks, I am a mod author and I am testing many mods um, and making a mod pack and building the Hafengar all in one. So, you know, even though I like to test everything properly, I do like to move through the quests and kill my enemies relatively quickly. Um, simply because, you know, time is, as I said, it's a precious thing. That's why I appreciate the time you share with me in my streams. Oh, here we go. Oh, I missed her. Go on, go get her then. Let's see what he does so I can evaluate him. I'll just deal with this guy again. Oh, look at that. He took her head off. Fantastic. Good cat. Good cat. Lovely jubbly. And, of course, we have many, many mods, you know, even improved ashes. Look at the quality of the ash pile there. Lovely. Um, spell impacts. Tons and tons of mods for the uh, TPUS um, 2 a mod pack that will be coming out along, you know, like with TPUSC, a total overhaul, you know, pretty much a full overhaul of textures and new locations and patches and so on. So you can run, you know, the TPS uh, series without any issues in game. Again, so far so good. Again, I just want to do a lighting test. I like to do this often because it's important. I get a sense of how the cells are lit, what you're going to experience. Okay, it's really nice. Okay, let's move on. And I do like darker interiors, but again, folks, you can. Again, I think it's light enough for you to see. But again, with all EMB modern presets, um, what am I thinking about here? What's going on here? Let me just. You can, you know, darken them further, or you can lighten them up. Okay, that's much lighter. You might like that, but I don't. I do like a darker interior. But as long as you can see the stream, that's what I'm going to go with. All right. It's not too dark for you, is what I'm saying. Let's move on. Lovely reflection in the water here, as I as I move my eyes in, you know. I can hear a bones, but I can't see him. That's lovely. Oh yeah, have some of that. <laughs> I haven't. I've actually loaded up the new death animation. Um, it's recently in hot files uh, but I've done that for the MO2 build um, I haven't added it to the Vortex build because I'm doing an MO2 build for Wobberjack um, for TPS2 and I will do it for TPSC down the line as well and I'm also doing a Vortex um, TPS2 AE um, mod, mod pack build as well so you know so, so the currently the MO2 build has some mods loaded up that the um, Nexus uh, Vortex pack hasn't had it, hasn't got yet, sorry, but I will add them. Um, so all these updates and all these changes will be forthcoming, you know, as the season goes on. You know, okay, folks, so, but like I say, we're still in the early days of creating this mod pack for TPS2. We've got a lot of patching and doing a lot of work. But it, we've had no CDTs and no major issues. So, so far, what we've come across so far have been minor. And if Helgen Reborn does show any um, bugs, the, there is the main quest bug that people seem to talk about. I'm gonna, I do have some questing knowledge, of course, and I'm building my own quests in the future, and I have built quests, but um, I will see if I can fix it, and I will put that out as a standalone patch for the community, um, and an all-in-one patch for the mob pack. But again, I'm, I'm not into butchering other people's work. I'll only be happy if it's a quality patch, and I've, you know, I'm happy with what I've done. And if I, you know, because again, it's, um, I have lots of skills in building. I have quite a bit of skill in quest building, but like I say, um, and nav mesh is, is probably what I would say I'm best at. 
honestly, to be, you know, I'm a tidy builder as well, and I provide stable mods, and I know how to produce good and stable mods, but, um, you know, my questing, even though I have questing knowledge, it isn't extensive yet. It will be by the time I'm finished my TPO, oh shit, my TPOS series. Come here, you git. See, like there, did you see how she hooked onto that chair? She didn't move round it cleanly. It's these sort of things that I put in the all-in-one patch as well. Hello? For the you, oh Control. shit. Go on, get her. I'll let him take her out. So I, is there someone else? There is, there's something else, isn't there? What's going on? Oh no, she's hitting me. Oh no, there is someone else. There, look. Take them out. Oh, she's quite strong. Well, okay, all right. I forgot what I was saying. Oh yeah, about the patches, folks, you know. So um, yeah, you know, by the time I'm done, uh, my questing knowledge would have built as well, my skill. I mean, it's not bad, but I've still got a hell of a lot to learn. And I'm gonna have to do some papyrus, um, some scripting. Um, in, you know, I'm gonna have to try to write some scripts to um, perform some of the, um, in, or if you, what, what I'm trying to say is to reach some of the objectives of my quest because they don't exist at the moment. So that's what I'll need to do. I need to learn and I will have to write uh, some scripts for the TPS3 um, quest, definitely. TPS2, uh, sorry, TPSC questing version, which is coming next uh, in a year or so, is, is going to be fairly easy. And I'm going to use scripts that are already around. Um, the TPSC quest is basically really about providing backstories for all the generic NPCs and inserting two main quests into the TPSC. They're big quests, but there isn't you know, all the scripts are there for me to do what I want to do. TPS3 is going to be a real challenge. So, so like I say, I will fix Helgen Reborn if I can. Um, and I'll put it out as a single, if it needs it. Um, because we are, you know, if it needs it. Because um, it could be people are just wrong about, I don't know if they are, I'm just saying. Well, all I'm saying is, whatever we come across, I'll see if I can fix it. It's an individual patch for users that use Helgen Reborn. And for the mod pack, TPS2 AE mod pack, okay? And I'll take a little breath there and just play now for a bit. So you don't have to pull up with me waffling and going on all the time. And I'll have a drink and I'll just let you enjoy why we... Uh, in fact, let's turn to a sword, all right? Let's just play the game a little bit here. I'll just go to a basic sword. And we can see some nice fighting effects. Okay. Nice interior. Well done, matey. Let's go. Let's do this. I'm a bit more bit more reckless now we're just running through <clears throat> what's that there did I see no sorry Oh, we're close. We're close to this guy now. You can see the marker. What's going on? Oh. <laughs> Walked into a wall. Well done, Nesbit. Clever. Ah, that's Bard. Bollocks. Is that Bard from the other... I see. Okay. Look at that. This is what I love about Lux. Look, at, I, I love the depth of field that I've got set up. I mean, it's it, obviously it's um, you know I've I've edited the depth of field for f my liking, but I just love the depth of field in third person mode. And again, with Lux interior lighting and the EMB presets set in suns, we've also got luminosity with Lux as well, which seems to be so far working really well, because luminosity doesn't add or remove any light sources. I don't think, if I remember correctly, it just changes the palette in effect I think if I'm correct in saying so look at that look that's fantastic I hope you're seeing it I hope you're seeing it as nice an image or you know in game as I'm seeing it's not gonna be as sharp I suppose but very nice where are we going let's just speed this up a bit yeah he's still a bit of a distance from me so I think I'm relax a little bit here what's that there I'm gonna jump down here because I can Okay. Oh shit, are we back? <laughs> I thought for a minute we were back at the beginning. Are we back at the beginning? Oh, what's going on? I'm in the wrong place, folks. I think I'm in the wrong place. Am I? 
Oh, what am I doing, Nesbit? What are you doing? I did this yesterday. I thought I'd got to where this warlock was. I swear it was here. Ah, I'm in the wrong place again. I did that yesterday. What's the matter with me? That's what happens when you talk all the time, folks. When you're always bloody talking. And, you, you know, I'm concentrating on what I'm um, saying about, you know, the TPS series, the mod pack, and all the mods I'm running, and one thing or another. And I actually end up in the bloody wrong location. <laughs> Sorry about that, folks. I'm a bit dense at times. <laughs> Just call it busy. <laughs> okay, right. All right, let's do this. I mean, oh, there he is. Look, go I'd enough. I don't, I'd like to make things hard for myself, don't I? Eh? Okay, sorry about that. Let's um, use the... Here we go. Is my guy with me? He's a neck... My guy doesn't seem to have caught up at the moment. Ah, right, he's up here. Okay, all right. Okay. He'll catch up, I'm sure. So I was in the wrong place again. I did that yesterday, folks. I was talking so much about, you know, the technical and what's going on. I forgot to, um, <laughs> I ended up in the wrong place. So, all right, we're in the right place now to kill this warlock. <laughs> Duh. <laughs> like I say, I got a lot in my head all the time. So much to think, to remember. That's my excuse anyway. <laughs> what was that? Oh, huh? here we go. Move, move. Why are you moving so slow? Come on. God, I love the effects here, the magic effects, the fire, brilliant. I'll, I'll stick with my weak sword. Oh, I'm getting hit. Gosh, she's got some strength to her. I'm going to have to heal up. Again, I am cheating with my potions, you'll notice. They're actually hitting quite strong because i got to... Oh, stuff this. <laughs> I'm just going to end this. <laughs> <laughs> Get rid of that one. <laughs> uh, as you can see, I'm a fantastic warrior, folks. <laughs> oh no, what's going? I'm suffering here. They're kicking the shit out of me. <laughs> Good job I can cheat with some potions. <laughs> Lovely effects. I love the effects here. I got, you know, power of three and now what's left? Oh, this is excellent. Yeah. And in my EMB preset, folks, um, I'll talk in a minute when I finish it. God, I'm hitting shit. <laughs> oh, thank God for that. <laughs> a bit. Look at that. Look at the interior light, and I love it. Excellent. So, um, that was pretty intense, actually. I wasn't expecting that. That was actually an effort. <laughs> and that's with my, my cheat sword. Look at this. Look. She's got a bit of a collision going on there. <laughs> we got more skeletons. Okay, let's move on. I'm going to save up there just in case, because like I say, we don't know what we're going to come across. Oh, and I've just seen the poll's been... Um, okay, so will we see E6 released before 2033? 25% says yes. 75% <laughs> says no. No one said not in your lifetime, Nesbit. Honestly, I won't be offended, folks. I don't think it will be <laughs> the rate we're going, because we've got Starfield as well. But anyway... Let's uh, move on with this uh, Helgen Reborn questline. You're doing well, Cat. Let's keep going. I'll give you a good report just for that. That was tough. Um, journal, have I finished my check? No, not yet. Okay. What was I saying? Oh, the e &B preset set in suns, right? I, I just want to say this because I really like it. I, I really bumped up the particles and some other effects. So if you get like if you're standing in front of big fireplaces or you're being attacked by a dragon who's got fire or again um, necromancers or someone's hitting you with fire yeah you get blinded for a few seconds i, I mean xd embers really helps with this anyway by the way that's made but i've just accentuated those effects in my um presets and particles and all the rest of it so hello jack i was tempted oh sorry jack i missed that comment I was tempted, low. Oh, right. Oh, yeah, with Not In Your Lifetime, Nesbit. I'm with you. Oh, uh, yeah. Nice to see you, Jack. And uh, again, thanks for sharing your time with me, folks. Let's get on with this quest. So, yeah, some, you know, some real... I mean, look at the... I just... I love Skyrim, man. Look at this. The ash pile, the EMB particle effects, and just everything. Just lovely. That's why I love... I love... Oh, hold on, Mike. I'm going back out here. 
Let's open up the map. Which way am I going? Yeah, I'm going the wrong way. <laughs> okay, so. Oh, thanks for the likes, folks. I've got six people and six likes. I appreciate it. Let's move on. Right, now. And again, share the streams if you can, folks. If you think people will like it. Look at this. I And again, Matthew's plants. and Just love it. Okay, let's move on. I'm going to turn to my bow, I think, right now. And I did just save, but I'm going to do that again while I'm here. Because you never know. But like I said, we've been, or I've been very fortunate. I've been very careful with my choices. But, and that's why I say, you know, even if you don't have patches with TPUS2 AE, um, just, again, if you put a lot of mods after it, some can go before it. You know, the patching will be relatively small. Um, and, and it will be even less because I will be removing cells that TPUSC sorry tps2 ae doesn't require all right let's take out the necromancer first because he can bring back the dead nice that's the quest complete i think let's just deal with this skeleton oh i missed him god damn it it looks great in here though lovely what i'd really love is a mod that would angle the ashes folks not in someone's done it. Not in your lifetime. Did you change your vote, Jack? <laughs> um, and a mod. I wonder if anyone could make a mod, whether it was like, you know, someone clever that's good with that sort of thing, you know, that could angle the um, ash piles. So they were angled on the stairs when something died rather than like that. That's one of the last few things that really sort of grate my cheese, if you like. <laughs> Sorry, grate my... <laughs> but, you know, you know, sort of just winds me up a bit. So, have we killed him or not? I don't think we have. Let's just bring up the map. No, we still got this guy to do. Let's again. It's been a while since I've played Helgen Reborn, so um, I can't really remember it to be honest with you. A lot of it. So, <laughs> okay, mate. <right. laughs> I had someone contact me yesterday, folks. You got to listen. Let me just, because obviously you got the enemies. I got to tell you this, this, this little story, right? I'm just gonna have a, a strawberry while I'm telling you this, because I got these little bits of fruit because I get a dry throat. <laughs> Not that you really need to know that, but yesterday I had someone email me and they said, um, and, and this was what they said, all right? Pretty much, and they said, um, I was watching your stream yesterday, and he said, um, he said, he said I always had a dislike for you. <laughs> I would always thought you were a bit of a twat. <laughs> and he said, you're not quite what I expected. And I said, oh, I said, I get that a lot, <laughs> you know. But he said, oh, I liked your stream. <laughs> and he said, I might catch it again in the future. Have a nice day. <laughs> that was one of the funniest conversations I think I've had in a long time. I said to him, as long as you're not like a, I don't act like a cunt, you know, I'm all right. <laughs> I don't mind honesty as long as it's not totally indifferent, you know. <laughs> I just laughed my ass off. I just thought, oh, God, that's so fucking funny. <laughs> anyway, there you go. Life of a mod author. <laughs> oh, God. Sorry about me language there, folks, but God. here we go. Let's take these gits out. Where are they? All right, there. We'll have you. Oh, shit. Mister. Ow! Ah, uh, that's him. Oh, another one. Right in my face. There's a lot of them. Oh, I'm switching to me sword. Stuff this. So there you go, folks. <laughs> oh. Lovely. You think you stand a chance? Why? Okay, right. Where is the rest of them? Is it down? Ah, there she is. Okay, let's... Uh... Yeah! <laughs> so there you go. Um, another funny story if you want to hear it. I don't know if you want to hear it or not, but tell me if you don't. You know the way Dwemer Tower. I think I've told this one before, but it's another funny story. You get all sorts of comments people throw at you. But, um, I once had a, a female contact me and she asked for help about her load order. And um, I sort of told her that, you know, she, had, she was trying to run um, mods that, you know, just conflicted with, with mine. 
that shared the same cells, so there's nav mesh conflicts and all the rest of it. I, and I tried to help her, and I tried to tell her she had, to make, she had to make choices about the different mods, what she wanted to run, or get it patched. And um, she didn't want to hear what I had to say, not really. She ended up getting frustrated with me, and, she, <laughs> and then she started uh, making the point that um, the Dwemer Tower that I put in at near ha Half Moon Mill uh, is like a penis extension because I got, had a small dick. <laughs> I mean, she said it more eloquently um, and with more... Um, aggression, let's say, but I mean, it was just just another funny comment. I uh, yeah. So apparently, I stick these towers into my Skyrim game because uh, I lack manhood. <laughs> you know, like men that have big cars and all the rest of it. I just thought it was so fucking funny. <laughs> anyway, let's move on. Where are we going? Over here, I think. Ah. So I'm just gonna look at the Poe again because that made me laugh as well. Yeah, so that's basically about one vote for... So most is 60%. I don't think we're going to see it either. There you go, folks. Right, what's going on here? What's going on here? I'm just checking some textures. <laughs> you got to laugh, Jack. you got to laugh. I don't take it, you know, I mean... Occasionally I find people really offensive, but oh, I I think I'm missing something here. Let me just focus on what I'm doing Is that we come in I'm just I've, I'm a bit disorientated on folks Let's just see what I'm doing here. He is he's in here. So I think I've got to go down this way, haven't I? Where am I going is it back here? So that's where we come down what's going on I'll answer that in a minute Jack just get a bit, I've just totally lost my bearings here so we came we're going out there surely because that's where right there's a there's a passageway somewhere here is there by the looks of it is it let's bring in some light I need some light Bring up the map. Yeah, there should be a, there's a doorway there. I'm being dense. Can't seem to work out what it is I'm supposed to be doing. Oh. Oh, there's a werewolf there. I don't call him. What's this here? That's... We're not going to be going back up the stairs, are we? Because we've just been up those damn things. What's going on? Is there a... Uh, I, there might be a turning before. Oh, shit. Just missed it. There might be a turning before. So this is the way out down here. I think I've worked it out. I think I've worked it out, folks. Um, is there a... Is there a cave there? I can see an arrow. Where am I going? It's like something. Just go up here. Have I come... Oh, God, man, what's going on? Okay, I'm having a mare right now. Map. Where's the stairs in relation? That's the way out. And again, I'm in the right place, aren't I? I'm just going to um, go back up these stairs a minute. Answer that question, Jack. Um, what it is, what it is, Jack, I mean, you know, so, sometimes I get things wrong in terms of I miss something. I mean, I admit, I've had a go at someone before because I just thought they were being a, indifferent. And it actually turned out, I, you know, I got it wrong. And, and that happens sometimes. Um, but sometimes, yeah, you just get people that really don't know how to mod. And as soon as you try to help them, they don't like it. Or they're deliberately trying to provoke you anyway, because that's how they get their kicks. Uh, and and those are the ones you just laugh at, because you recognize what they're doing. Oh, is this the way? Hold on a minute, folks. I think I might have... No, I don't know if it is. Let's have a look. Let's just go up here a minute. Oh, we've been down here. No, okay. Yeah, so you just, you just get on with it, you know. My focus is the project. 
and just having a, you know, trying to enjoy um, uh, the people that enjoy my work and enjoy it myself, you know? Oh, here we go. What's this? Ah, found it, folks. I'm there. Okay. You know, and that's what's important. I, in in the past, I, I put too much focus on the... Oh, shit. What oh, that? walked right into him. Damn, look at those flames. Oh, lovely. All right, folks, I found my bearings. Okay. I think I have. What's going on here? There must be a lever. Where's... Oh, shit. Where's the lever? Where's the lever? I need a torch. See what I'm doing? Ah, okay. All right. Well done, cat. Good cat. Okay, so we must be going around. So let me just pause there. And let me just save. Because I realise I'm safe for a while. Um, so yeah, folks. I mean, if you're a mod author or even if you're a user, try not to get involved. Because, you know, it don't matter at the end of the day. You know? <laughs> Stay focused on the, on the project, on your game. Don't get drawn in. It's just childish, most of it, anyway. Okay, where are we to? This way, I think. I'll let my guy take guy of the take care of the ne necromancers behind me. And I'll big him up for that. I'll take these guys out. Oh, lovely. Go on, take his head. Whoa, lovely jubbly. Oh, he's still got his head. Oh, that's because he's got his helmet on. Oh, I see. It's, it's not his helmet, sorry. His, um, his um, hood. There's his head. It came out of his... <laughs> that was weird. Okay, right. Move on. Good stuff. Where are you? Oh, I see. I can't go through there. What? Oh, I've got to go. I've got to go at the top there. I think, haven't I? We got to go up those um, steps. Let's go back then. Down, down, down. And again, you know. It's like, like, I'll say this as well, folks, because I do come across people that get upset. But I'd say this, you know, the, the only evaluation that matters is your own. Um, you know, about yourself. Your own conscience, your own conscience with you, you know. Um, how you feel. There must be a lever there. I've got to get a lever. Where's the lever? Is it down here? Logically, it'd be down here, wouldn't it? In that place. But let's just have a look for a lever. I'm just going to light, bring a torch in, because I'm looking for a lever. There. Oh, no. I'm looking for a lever, obviously. Where is it? Let's see if it's in here, because it's generally how it works, isn't it? I can't see it. Is there... Oh, what's this? Another place? I missed that. There it is. Look, look at that, look. Okay, we got the lever. Very clever. I like that. That's a good touch. That's a nice touch. So now we can go back up. Up, up, up. Where am I? I like it when it's dark because it does confuse you. You do get lost and I like that, so. There we go. Excellent. Okay, we're on our way. Now we should... No, where's the second? There's a second lever then. All right. Where's that? Ah, there it is. Okay, that's good. I'm enjoying this, folks. This is good fun. Oh, Christ. Uh, I'm poisoned. No, man. Let's deal with that. Let's get... Let's take a... Just taking a potion of cure. I've been bitten or something. We're infected. Okay. Look at that. That's lovely. I love the light on the um, walkway there. The way it moves. I think that's very immersive. A lovely touch. And again, that... So you big up XD embers and the Lux patches and um, Mathy's torch... And other um, EMB particles and stuff as well. So very nice. I don't really need a torch if I'm sneaking, do I? Let's go to my bow. So yeah, very, very nice. Again, I'm not so sure about these... I don't know what's going on with these walls. I mean, they are 4K. They're supposed to be. I might look at um, other cave textures, I think. I'll just make sure I got my overwrites correct. Quite sure I have, but anyway, there you go. Oh, didn't mean to do that. Let's pick that back up. 
Out the way, cat. Oh, go on then. You deal with it. Ha, found you. Oh, look. <laughs> the necromancer um, that was raised had the hour up there. Get with him. Go on. Deal with it. Ah. There we go. Let's just get rid of her. Okay. Um, nothing now I really need. There's nothing else I've got to collect, I don't think. Well, that's him trained up. That was... That was I enjoyed that. Um, that's what I really like about Helgen Reborn. The big upside of Helgen Reborn. That was a nice quest just for training this one individual. I mean, some of them are smaller, I know. But that was enjoyable. The cave dungeons were nice systems. Um, you know, finding the levers and everything. Took a bit of th um, thinking about. That was good, man. I enjoyed that. And that's just that one little quest. Wonderful. So it will take a, you know, a good week to probably maybe finish Helgen Reborn. Maybe. Um, now, if I remember rightly, we can fall down to the bottom of this, uh, can we? I can't remember. Let's just go through here. Oh, look. All right. No, I'm going the wrong way. Okay, let's get out of here. Oh, there's a dog is there. Giotto like, ah, oh, where's the dog? Oh, he's found it. Giotto's found his dog, folks. Oh, he's found himself a dog. Oh, God, I'm running back up here again. Jesus, Nesbit, get your shit together. Where am I going? Where's out? I thought it was... Okay. All a bit dark around here. I'm going up, up, up. If I can get up. <laughs> oh, I'm glad I got this jump mod, especially when it's the damn dark. There we go. So very much for finding Disha. Ah, you got your I dog. Love him and care for him. I knew you liked dogs. Excellent. <laughs> okay, let's move on. Let's go to first person, I guess. Here we go. Okay. Okay, so good. Do I want nothing there really? And where's the way out? I can go that way as well by the looks of it. So, uh, where are we going? Mm -mm -mm. I'm just going to go slow. Enjoy the lighting that I'm seeing. It's nice. There we go. There's. Yeah. Oh, wrong way. And again, that's the thing with dark. I, I, you know, again, dungeons, dark dungeons are a pain in the ass, really, in some ways, especially if you're streaming. But I, I do like them. Um, I'm actually, you know, but again, because you can, you, you, know, you can only see with the current light, light sources, and I sort of feel pretty much that's the way the game should be you know there shouldn't be like in a in a cave or whatever if there's no light source for it i don't like that but that's my personal taste um i've just upped it though just a little bit just so you can see because i thought it's a bit dark folks there and there we go we're uh and i'm gonna put it back that's good back we go to um helgen lovely that was fun i enjoyed that again thanks for sticking with me folks sharing your time oh quick save i hate quick saves just gonna delete that it's a dark night what time in what time in 9:32 it is dark it's nice, like it. And let's see what it's like with the torch. Very good. <laughs> let's move on. That cat did very well. He'll get a good report.
just going to move through to the day so there's some light for you to see. That's rather nice. What's that there? What the hell is that? Oh, it's a plant. Oh, it's one of Matthew's trees. It was a depth of field that deceived me. I thought I just had floating leaves there for a second. Let's just go another hour into the day. That's what I want. Give you plenty of light. See the textures and everything. Okay. There he is. And again, I will just remember, just highlight, folks. If you're using Dragonborn voiceover, just be careful with some NPCs of not um, trying to rush the dialogue. Nothing new to report. You are doing a great job with these recruits. Give it up. Yeah, especially with um, quests that aren't patched for for the Dragonborn voiceover. Just let that silent space play out. Excellent. What is your evaluation of this recruit? Superb. <laughs> Did he now? Well, I'll have to keep a closer eye on this one. Thank you for your report. You're welcome. What's next? What's next? There you go. So there is one line that the bandit leader, uh, um, that the Dragonborn voiceover mod, is not happy that he killed his people and took over Helgen. In shares with we have it Helgen. in good authority that he's trying to recruit his forces near Pine Watch, and they have dug out the old mine there. They are making weapons and preparing to attack us, and take Helgen back for themselves. Take that little Nord herd with you, and see what you can find and report back to me. Recruit, okay. stand tall, soldier. Recruit, I don't give. I, in recruit. my patch, I will just I um. Say. Level off well this, uh, the textures Keep here so they blend in nicely, soldier. more You'll nicely, less jagged. For you, here after all, Cadman. you may resume your normal duties. This mist. Feel like I need a bath. Sir, I might have a bath in a minute. You, right, this is the guy that wanted to be an adventurer, folks. You know, in his well. <laughs> Let's see what he's got. Let's just leave it at that. Right away. I can't wait to show you what I can do. But, uh, where are we going? Bandits have neither courage or honor. I will give them a coward's death. <laughs> Always follow tool when you release your arrow. Okay, I'm just looking at this texture here. I think... I'm not sure what's... I think this has got to do with the Helgen Reborn mod. Maybe it um, provides some of its own textures. Because I've got no other Poe that looks like that, folks. So I reckon it must be part of the Helgen Reborn mod. So... You know, everything else is... Um, Mathy's Walkways or Fusher's uh, work. So, yeah. But anyway... Maybe I'll see if I can somehow deal with that within a patch as well. Because um, it's little things like that that just piss me off, really, to be honest with you. Because you've got this lovely looking game. And, you know, I mean, in its day, it just needs replacing. I guess I could use um, object the object swapper, couldn't I? Something like that. Um, let me think. What are we doing? Where are we going? Eliminate the bandit threat, which is where? Where's that? Okay, so let's... Oh, it's not far. Oh, that's going to be on that bridge, isn't it? I know where I'm going. Yeah, 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 I know where I'm going. Let's uh, do it. Can we go... Oh, this isn't... This isn't... Oh, wait, there is a space to get by now, look. Is there? Oh, well, I'm going to go through it anyway. Yeah, okay. Looking nice. Looking really... I'm going to walk so you can see this, folks. And you are literally just behind me in the stream. I've got to tell you, folks. I'm getting a, um, a V8 cable... Um, this month, hopefully, along with my um, full Discord membership. That's what I'm hoping to do. So I can... Um, oh, jump, jump. Yeah, that's right. He's following me. Oh, we could have gone that way. Oh, I didn't realise that. <laughs> we could have actually gone the other way. What was I saying? 
I'm just going to walk slowly so you can see the quality of... Uh, oh, piss off. There we go. Uh, damn, it's the phone. My missus will get that, I guess. Um, what was I saying? Yeah, at the moment, I'm currently streaming um, via Wi-Fi. Um, and um, I had a bit of luck, really. I sp well, this is where his competition is good. Um, I you'd guess you may not want to know this, but I'll talk about it anyway. You know, we got Virgin Media and other companies. Um, and um, now the infrastructure is sort of growing for broadband. Prices are coming down dr drastically. Um, I just got an upgrade on my Wi-Fi in broadband um, for less money than I was paying on the original package, which is really good. But I've always used um, Wi-Fi, but I've actually, I'm going to get a 30 meter cable. It, cable. It's not too expensive for those V8 cables for streaming. So you've got re really, you know, really push through those streams up to the server, help quality and everything else. And so it'll be a hard wire and not Wi-Fi. So I'm really going to help. I really hope that's going to help our streams as well and the quality of the streams. Plus I'll have, um, instead of 150 megabytes, um, sorry, the 35 or 30 megabytes upload, I'll have 70 and uh, 500 download for a cheaper price. Um, for the 150 download that I had so that's really positive and um, I'm also again on discord I'm gonna be um, purchasing hopefully discord uh, package this month for $99 hopefully all being well and um, people can join me on the streams and watch me do the half and guy all in one build and interact if they want to all right and when I say you can talk in streams with the chat um, so you know, you talk about gaming and the mods I'm building. Give your own ideas if you like, um, own ideas if you like, and or talk about anything generally. Again, I would only say with that, you can, you know, um, if you find it hard to swallow um, other people's opinions that may not reflect your own. Oh shit! Just you know, then you know maybe it won't be your thing. I only say that. I only say that as a heads up, just in case, because people can be sensitive. Um, I sort of stand from the position that I'm confident in myself. I believe what I believe right now, or not necessarily even believe. I know or feel what I know right now is right for me. When I was a younger man, I used to feel and think differently and so on. So, and I won't state that um, my views are right or, or better than anyone else's, because that's bollocks, because we're all at different stages of evolution. I only say this and highlight this. So if you do join me, you know, come along if you can accept viewpoints that may not reflect your own. Because what I don't want to do is cause insult, whether insult was given or not, or have any arguments or falling out. You know, it's about having a good time. And I say that because uh, I've seen how other such situations have gone on other platforms. So, you know, if you're a mature adult or even a young adult that's, or a younger adult that's got a mature attitude, you're welcome. Always welcome in my streams or on my Discord. I welcome intelligent people I've got no problem with people having a different opinion to me they don't have to agree with me they don't even necessarily have to like me just as long as they're respectful simple as that and vice versa <laughs> okay so that's the only reason I highlight these points just you know for the sake of clarity and um, harmony and understanding so yeah but I'll be doing those at the beginning of um, this month coming I'll get my um, here's the bandit camp this must be it I think isn't it Oh, no, it's not. It's not. I don't think it is. Let's not make that mistake again. Oh, here we go. Oh, let's go. Uh, so there you go, folks. Come and join me if you want, all right? Let's eliminate these bandits. Time to get hardcore. What? How did you do that? <laughs> you should have been worried more about killing me, mate, than how I did that. Oh, I must level up as well. Oh, this is too much. They're too easy. Let's switch to my Berserker Sword, right? That's a bit too easy, really. See what I mean about those flames? How you lose um, sight for a minute. Or for a few seconds. Lovely. 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 Yay, I love that. I'm an animate. I'm going in the third person. Think you can take me? Lovely. Oh, yes. Have some of that. You're gone. You're out of here, girl. <laughs> oh, ow. E. <laughs> oh. You hear me? Missed. Yeah. 
good to see my guy uh, join in that's being trained. <laughs> Killer, come on. <laughs> oh, well done, mate. Well done, Hood. Good shit. Good man. All right. Is that it? Journal. We haven't eliminated them yet, I don't think. There's still more. Where are we going? That was just the start. Here we go. Oh, oh, look at this. Pulse. Time to die. Mercy. Yes. <laughs> Brilliant. All right. Good shit. Right, let's carry on. Let's get in this cave. Is this? Where's the cave? Oh, there it is. Ooh. -hoo. Right, what's, oh shit, man! Look, we have got a, a a conflict, maybe between a mountains mod, um, the mountain mod textures that I'm using. See the cave entrance. Oh shit! Bollocks. Ah, now that's not good. Um, did I just see the door there? Just about. Oh, aren't we lucky, eh? I would have had to have come out. Um, okay, so that's a patch required there for whatever the cause is causing that. But we just about got in there. And you're literally just a few seconds behind me still, folks. So I'm really pleased about this. Which means the upload, that input in upload has made a huge difference. So I can actually probably adjust my latency in OBS as well. That's really interesting. You see, that's why I think probably that's why I had all these problems as well, folks. With my um, earlier streams with OBS and that. I didn't have enough upload juice or, or you know, wife or sorry, broadband output. So things are getting better as each year goes by, really, in terms of this is why you need certain equipment and, and certain, you know, services to really stream well, you know, decent graphics cards. So, again, I'm, I'll say it now to everyone that's helped me. I thank you. I appreciate it. You know, without your support, TPSC, well, the TPS series, sorry, wouldn't be here. So, and I, you know, I, I'm in. You know, I'm, I'm grateful to a, a, a lot of people that have helped me out over the time. I've been very fortunate, and I still am fortunate. And recently, you know, it, in many ways, it's got easier, um, you know, so I appreciate that. Okay, let's move on. Yeah, nice and moody, nice and dark where there's no light sources or you know, there's only a little bit of light here but the, you can say that's emanating off the light behind me and in front of me so I like that that feels so well well balanced to me very immersive I really like it folks and the Helgen Reborn mod is a very nice mod you know it does offer a hell of a now, lot this is a now where are they I think they're up. there we go there's one I think I switched to my sword let's do this Lovely. Oh, look at those flames. Fantastic. Oh, shit. He moved. Stand still. Let me kill you. Stand still. God damn. See how hard it is to see them. With them fl That's fantastic effects. I love that. I'm just going to level up, folks. You're going to hear the music for a bit because I've got a lot of leveling up to do. So, unfortunately, you're going to have that repeated music for a bit, all right? Nothing undo about that. And, of course, when I started my testing, I entered a bat file, which gave me some cheats. Again, I'm testing, so I'm just letting you know if you see all that and you wonder what's going, going on. Because I'm cheating, because I am just testing at the moment. When the mod pack's complete and all the patches are done, we do a proper, we, we will do a proper playthrough. No cheating. All right, just so you know. Oh, shit. Oh, let's get these perks. I want that, because that really helps. And then we'll go to our bow in a sec. we got 12 left. Okay. Oh, didn't mean to do that. Go to our bow.
How many we got left? Four. That'll do. Okay. Where are we going? Okay. Oh, we're going up. We're going up. I think. I think I might just give you some more light, folks. Bear with me, all right? It does seem a bit darker in this particular cave, a little bit darker. So I'll give you some more light so I can see as well and I won't get so lost. So we came up here to eliminate those, but that's not... There we go, down here. Here we go. If death is what you want, you'll have it. Come on! Never should have come here. To get lost, friend. Go on. Ow! <laughs> Lovely. Oh, that was sweet. That was sweet. Well done. Good man. You can fight. Lovely. <laughs> Here we go. Ah. Where are we going now? Is this a dead end? Yeah, it is. Okay, so... Alright, back we go then. Oh, there's a... Alright, let's go through here. Maybe... Go on then, matey. Move. Oh, Christ. Let's close that door. <laughs> An easy kill. All right, we're going the right way. Brilliant. Up, I think. Is it up? Map. Yeah, looks like it. Yeah, I think I'm going the right way now. That's good. Switch to my bow. Oh, no, let's switch to some magic. Because I got a high level of magic usage. So let's have some fun. Look at, look at the, the effects now, folks. Let's check out some magic effects on the player, all right? We're, of course, using the runes spell mod um, by power of three. All right. Look at that. Now, that does look nice. Oh, a trap. Let's get around that. Ah! Didn't see that one. Have I not got... I have. They pretty much know I'm here, so I don't see the point in sneaking. Where am I going? Lost my bearings again. Oh! Ah! Down, down, down. Ah, we're going down here, I think. We haven't been down here, have we? You can't hide from me. Over here. Where is she? Ah. Oh, sorry, mate. Bandit chief. going on with my left hand? Oh, I see. Does Why is that dog attacking me? Isn't... Oh, you just killed her. You just killed your... D d oh, no. All right, okay. All right. Okay, so where am I? We're going... We're trying to look. get this way. Not going back that way. Light. I need light. 
That's better. Is there something in the water? I wonder. I can't remember. What's down here? Let's just put the torch out. Right. There we go. Is that some? Oh, why am I? What's going on with my animations? All right, it seems to sort themselves out. Do I have to go into the water? Just trying to look. What's that there? No. Nope, that's not the way through. Nothing there. I think I've got the torch on one, haven't I, yet? What's around here? Ah, here we... Is this it? No, nope, that's just a... Oh, it might be. Let's have a look. It might be. Have I been through here? Don't recall. Guess we'll find out. It could be the right way. Looks like it might be. I think we'll keep going. Let's go to bow. I think I'm in the right direct path now. Going to save then just in case. Need to backtrack or do something else. Okay. Oh. Ah. He hasn't responded. Ah. All right. <laughs> that requires a key. Ah. Oh, damn it, man. Ah. Shit. Uh, I think at this stage I'm going to cheat. I'm just going to unlock that. Hopefully I won't need the key for anything else. Let's see if he reacts. He does. Okay. <laughs> How do I get out of here? Oh, he got to go back round. All right. So that really didn't matter, I suppose. There's nothing on him, is there? Let's just check. There's nothing on him I need. And there's nothing I've got to do in that chest. Let's just unlock that chest just in case. Because um, I can't remember this quest. So rather than having to come back, as it's in the depth, it's for a reason. Let's have a look. Right. I'll see if I can find that key as well, I guess. Now, where did I come in? time is it all right we haven't been i'll tell you what, i feel like i've been in stream for a while but it hasn't been that long so far okay so we came in here and we were searching where we go in map I'm looking to get down there right okay can't hide from me let's go straight across for now Nah, that's got... What's that? And there might be something around... Oh, no, I doubt it. But I'm going to have a check anyway. I'm just going to check this whole cave system out. Might as well, I guess, as I'm here. That's going that way. Don't want to go that way. There's that, which isn't... Okay, so that's pretty much that then, by the looks of it. Okay, so I filled all the map there, so I know there's nothing there. Go back. Comments, no comments, and no further votes on the poll. Okay. Well, let's go this way. All right, okay, that leads me back there anyway. Oh, okay, that looks promising. Maybe if I can... So it's all around here. This is the bit I'm missing. There's something here I'm missing, isn't there? We've just gone through... All right, let's go through here then, because that seems to be... Unless it's a level... No, that seems right. So we go through here. All right. What's going on? Yeah, okay. And then we're going up here. Ah, I think I'm on it, folks. Okay. Okay, I finished the quest. All right, I finished the quest. God, I'm a dumbass. I thought I was still having to do something, but I've actually finished the quest. <laughs> Brain dead. Getting tired. Okay. Um, and again, you're right behind me. You're right behind me in the stream. That's good. So I'm just going to take a mental note of that. 
So we need some patch in there. Unless I've missed a patch on an install, but there's definitely some work there required. But again, some nice lighting there. All right, let's turn off my torch. I'm going to save. We go back to the fort. Oh, we got some workers added now. More workers. Got a nice sunset, whatever it is. Coming. Yes. I must say, if you pick sides in this civil war, I feel sorry for the other side. <laughs> Yes, very much so. Ah, I see. Perhaps this one will continue to surprise us. Thank you. Yeah, he fought bravely. I'm not going to give him a bad report. He jumped in when he needed to. Took a few out while I was busy. What's next? There's a new owner of the upper Embershard mine down below here who wants to resume operations there. But the rumor is that the mine is haunted and he can find anyone willing to go to work for him. Take Oriante with you, see what you can find and report back to me. Will do. Recruit, stand tall, soldier. Can I do some light testing? Well, kinsman, I didn't think you had it in you. Good job, soldier. You may resume your normal duties. Looks nice. Sir, thank you, sir. I need a bath. I'm going to have a bath in a minute, folks, before we continue. I think what I'll do is um, I'll pick up my guy. We've got a Riverwood. I'm going to get some food. Or girl, I should say. Yes, right away. But where are we going? Lead the way. Brilliant. Okay. So I'm just going to save there. And so far, folks, no problems, no issues whatsoever. Only um, the initial issues that were related to an animated door, which will be sorted. Oh, when you release your arrow. That's the time of day. That's the light dropping, I think I saw there. Where are we going on the map? Okay, so we're going there. So I'm just going to fast travel to Riverwood. And I'm going to have... Uh, This is Riverwood Grove, folks, that we got loaded in. Lovely stone textures there. I've been looking oh, God. Oh, riches beyond do. imagining. Hands only. Let's see here. I have a letter here. There's a new museum. Ah, yeah. a letter from the Jarl. Looks like that's it. Got to go. Riches beyond imagining. I found these words inscribed in ancient Morgan ruins. Oh, I know it. I believe they mark hard like you're doing. <coughs> You there. Oh, God. Dawnguard is looking for anyone willing to fight against the growing vampire menace. What do you say? Killing vampires? Where do I sign up? He's <coughs> Ron's going to like you. Go talk to him at Fort Dawnguard, southeast of Ripton. He'll decide if you're Dawnguard material. Okay, get rid of the torch. Get rid of that, get rid of the torch. In we go. Just think I have a little sleep, and I'm gonna have a little wash in the stream and freshen up. Let me know if you then we're going to kill uh, that. Look at that. Somewhere. I better turn it I thought I think I did, not I? Yeah, yeah, yeah. Okay. It is night time. As we go through the day, the inn will brighten up. There will be some edits to the e and preset setting suns as well, folks, all right? Um, probably a bit too dark, this. 
so we'll take yep actually let's just uh you'll take care of it don't i always i don't suppose i could convince you to take care of it now could i on the day of no death, we will drink i should have we'll guessed sing. we're the children of it's not what i want and we fight all our lives and when southern guard beckons every one of us dies what is it i'm looking for environment but this land is ours and we'll see it wiped clean of the scourge that has so is it this one i can't remember let's just let's just go up insanely just to get a no that's not the one which one was it we'll leave uh, let's just reset i can't remember what it was now I'll, I'll do that in my own time sorry folks i'm just thinking about the lighting in this inn i'll, I'll redo that because the knights will need uh adjusting we got rooms and need a room Talk oh to delphine. delphine where is she let's just open up these doors because that'll give us a bit more You're that visitor, oh. ben i'd like to rent a room sure thing it's yours for a day mind you that is quite nice that is immersive what light sources has she got around her let's have a look i really like that there's just a uh, there's a light source there and a, the and a candle that's been disabled. To Need to sort that out. Strangers. But there's no other heavy... Oh, light sources. Okay, it's coming from this. Take that back. That's right. Okay. But we do need some more light sources in there. I think that's a bit dark. Well, that is nice. It's still nice. I like it. I know it'll be way too dark for some people. Right, so asleep. And, of course, the inn will brighten up as we get through to the morning. Because they do. Let's go... Um, what am I doing? It's 10. And then we see the beams of light come through and Lux do its stuff. And I've added more Lux elements to the patch for um, the farmhouse. And I haven't finished yet, but I'm still working on the inns, folks, right? So you know. But you'll see as we go through the day, it's only, it should increase in its intensity a little bit more. It's coming in. Ah, that's bouncing in. There's still work to do on the inns. Um, let's just go through another hour. All right. Um, so yeah, you can see the lighting effects of Lux coming in. But there's still some edits and there's still some, some work to do on the interiors for TPOS 2AE. And I'm going to be um, changing some of the inns up and adding more Lux effects for Cities of the North, the interiors there in the all-in-one patch. Okay, so it's all in my sort of unique style. Um, I'm just going to go and have a wash in the stream because I feel a bit grubby. We've been adventuring for days, so let's uh, have a little wash. What am I doing? This is Jay Spearer's version, folks, all right? Lovely. Oh, I feel nice and clean. <laughs> Let's have a look at him in the light. Yeah. Good stuff. All right. Save. This is um, Riverwood Grove, a TPSC mod. Sorry, a TPS2 mod add-on, which is part of the installer. I just love checking out these wood textures. Absolutely fucking lovely. Very nice. Uh... It's just a fishery, basically. It's all built around the industry of the village, you know. A small little village. Hadfar's got himself a little ledger. Love that ledger. Can't remember the author, but big up the author of this ledger. Just so much better than the Skyrim one. Um, you know, so Renthal's water wheel. Adapted by uh, Fusher. And we've got JK's interiors as well. Um, actually, let's just go in because I want to pick up some cure potions and then we'll get on with the Helgen quest line, right? The river, my sister Camilla, or I will be happy to help you. What have you got for sale? 
Some may call this junk. Me, I call them treasures. Okay, I want that. That's really all I need. What can I sell? Damn thieves! As if things weren't bad enough. I just Maybe realized. You're looking for something. Did particular. something happen? Uh, yeah, we, we did have a bit of a, a break in, but we, we still have plenty to sell. Robbers were only after one thing an ornament, solid gold in the shape of a dragon's claw. Wait, you mean this golden claw? <laughs> you found it. <laughs> there it is. Strange. It, it seems smaller than I remember. <laughs> Funny thing, huh? I'm going to put this back where it belongs. I'll, I'll never forget this. You've done a great thing for me and my sister. Okay. It means so much to us to have the claw back where it belongs. Thank you. Lovely. Okay. Get out of the way. Thank you. Thank you so much for taking... You're welcome. Right, let's go. Questy, questy. Let's continue the Helgen Reborn quest. And we're going to eliminate... The haunted presence in the mine. Okay, and that's just behind us. So let's do this. The only thing I haven't added, folks, um, with the TPSC mod pack, and I won't for the TPS two. I do have some basic um, sign upgrades from Fusher's um, all-in-one pack, I think. Um, but the farmhouse doors, I try to keep very sim simple. Okay, and the reason I do that is because when you start adding quests like um, Bruma um, and other quests, uh, what am I trying to say? They, the doors don't fit properly with the models. Um, and so instead of doing lot of, lots of patching, I just stick with mods that, um, you know, that uh, they don't edit the farmhouse doors too much or the signs so there's less conflict. Actually, we don't really need that, but what I'm going to do... Let's just go back through the village. Well, uh, what am I thinking about? What am I? Th I'm thinking about. Uh, I have got it, haven't I? Bear with. Oh, I haven't picked it up yet. Okay, let's go and pick it up. Just here. Don't gotta go far. Heard they're reforming the Dawn Guard. Vampire hunters or something. In the old fort near Rifton. Might consider joining up myself. Let's have some fun. The mountain on this is a bit skew with, but otherwise it's brilliant. Look at that. That's fantastic. <laughs> right, let's go to our quest. We will take the long way around, just for the hell of it. Just because I'm going to be riding this beast. Okay. A bit more difficult to steer than the horse, but still great fun. Just takes a bit of practice. I still haven't quite mastered it, but it's fantastic. I, ho I hope you, yeah, you can see pretty well. The quality of the stream looks really nice, actually. Even moving at speed, it seems a l little less blurry. Again, I presume that comes to upload speeds and better, you know, f facilities this end. And, and it should be even better with those V8 cables that I was reading about. I didn't even know they existed. Because I obviously haven't had the money to sort of invest in such stuff until, oh, you know. And the cables themselves aren't expensive, but it was about the broadband. Now I've got this updated broadband package and I can have a 500 megabyte download speed and so on. I'll, um, it's worth getting that cable, is what I'm trying to say. So hopefully my streams will get even more better quality. Because that's really what it's all about. This is lovely though. I do love the rich um, texture of this, like the streams, folks. Um, again, I know it may not be your thing because we've all got different tastes, but I love the saturation 
of the setting suns and lux and everything that's going on in the, this game. It's really my sort of thing. I love Fusher's mod mods. I love the the little watery mud pack. Where am I going? The literary little watery puddles that you got. In fact, I might be going. That's Riverwood. Okay. <coughs> I'm going to go up the back end of it. I think. I think I am going to try to go up here. Can I get up here? I don't think I can. Maybe not. No, I'll just carry on going down here then. Oh, oh. <laughs> oh, I love that. Look at that road. Look at the quality of that. That's just fucking fantastic. Forgive my French, you know, but just look at that. That's brilliant. I love Matthew's work as well, you know. That's excellent. That's a screenshot right there, folks. I'm saving for later. Just zoom on in, you know, bit of depth of field. Lovely. we're going up good stuff or oh is it up there all right let's dismount really nice i love that cern fantastic oh just died have to resummon so hold on one sec folks Okay, so, um, yeah, I think I was going the right way, but I need to get on foot now and prepare. Here we go. Where's Dow? What am I doing? Oh, this is weird. Oh, oh dear. Got to get through there. Wow! Wow, oh, that was a screw. I missed it. Shit. That was a fantastic screenshot, that would have made. God, dear me, man. Ah, oh, man. Look at this. This is really cool. I can't even be quite sure what's what's doing this. Oh, have I got... Is it a vampire thing? It might be, actually. It is. Ah, am I infected? I thought I took a cure. Ah, damn it. Oh, that was weird. That was really good. I like that. Got a bit excited there. That's a nice effect. Okay, one thirty-four in stream, and the time's one eleven GMT UK time. I'll go for another half hour, folks. Okay, and then I'm gonna come on that stream and have some lunch. Yeah, I'm bloody. Oh right, okay. Oh, that's my predator vision. That's predator vision, isn't it? It's something like that. I'm sure that it's been so long since I've had a predator vision, folks, since I've been a vampire. I've forgotten what, what was going, you know? That's what I say. Oh. Excellent. <laughs> Look at that. Cool. Oh, hello. 
<laughs> Did you come to play with me? I don't have any friends here, and I'm so lonely. Come and play with me, and we can play forever and ever. I don't think so. You'll see. <laughs> Just come on, and let's play. You're not scared, are you? Yes, I am. <laughs> Oh, wow. <laughs> Missed him. What's going on? Oh, multiples. Did you see him? Did you? He was up there on the ledge for just a second. You must have made him really mad for him to come out like that. I'm Hannah. And he's a very mean and nasty man. My mommy and daddy used to work in here, and they'd bring me along to play sometimes. But one day, there was this big cave-in, and I haven't seen them since then. Yes, I know. They're dead. And I know I'm dead too. Because of the bad man. He won't let me leave and go be with mommy and daddy. He makes me be mean to other people who come in here. But it's him, not me. I don't want to scare and hurt people. He makes me. I'm scared all the time and just want to go home. Hey, I know what. If you can make him go away. Maybe I can go be with my family. You killed his spiders, his skeletons, and even his dragon. I bet you can kill him, too. Can you help me, please? Okay, first you need to go to the bottom of the mine. It's scary down there and you can hear miners, but... You can't really see them much. I think they're trapped here, too. But they won't ever talk to me. But you might need to kill them all. It will make him mad, and he'll probably come after you again like when you killed the others. I better go before he comes back. He won't like me talking to you, but I'll try and see if I can talk to you later. Okay, am I actually in the right part of the quest? I'm just thinking to myself. Map. Sorry, map. L. Yeah, I'm in the right place. I just don't recall this, folks, but there you go. Is there something else? Oh, I'm not in the right place. Am I in the right place? Yeah, I think I am. I'm not an Embershire. Oh, upper Embershire mine, okay. I don't recall this. It's part of the Dragon... I'm um, sorry, the Helgen Reborn quest. Um, I'm feeling a bit confused there. <laughs> But I'm sure it'll, it will become clear in a sec. Let's just make sure. Yeah, there's nothing else. Okay. Well, take it's correct. I take it it's correct. Let's go down. Right, well, I might as well just uh, drop down rather than walking all the way down. Oh, we'll go down properly, I guess. Excellent. <laughs> Brilliant. Look at all these guys, look. What's going on? Are they behind me? Oh, they're behind us. Look at the effects here, folks. Outstanding. Oh, shit. Sorry, mate. I didn't mean to do that. You're on my side. Oh, I switched my sword close up now. Oh. God, they're hitting. Blinking hell. Wow, that's a challenge. Even with my... Excellent. Oh, this is outstanding. Some real nice effects here, folks. Jesus, they can hit. How many's left? I think I'll stick with my big sword. Wow.
don't think there's much point sneaking really at the moment. Oh shit, where am I going? I've, where am I going? Nice little roll there. Let's uh, get back up. I've probably come too far down. Let's just... Right, this must be a door then, yeah? Some sort of passageway maybe? What am I missing? Can't see anything. Oh, I'll have that. That's useful. Let's go back up then, because um, I can't see nothing there. So I'm being dense. Yeah, okay. All right, let's see what else is going on. Here we go. Okay. You, you were here to help me. Now I know you can help me go home. Well, <laughs> I've just <laughs> seen the polls been updated, <laughs> folks. <laughs> Not in your <laughs> lifetime, Nesbit. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> yes, you for thirty-three percent. <laughs> See ya, Hannah. <laughs> right, so where am I going? What's happening now? This way, I guess. Is it? Looks like it. There was something red back there. Is it this way? Yeah. Looks like it might be. Let's save just in case. Where are they? What I want is unrelenting force, so I got a bit. What just happened there? I love the little Rosie's doing, or she's doing, sorry. <laughs> Here we go. Oh, wow, what, wow. So, yeah, of course, I was cheating with my blade, folks, you know. Oh, oh, oh. Whoa! Oh, whoa! <laughs> Shit! Where, where, where? Where? Can't see. Where's this? Where's this enemy? What's going on here? Oh, I. All right, hold on. Oh, he's. Where is he? I can't see him. Okay. I think we completed it, didn't we? Yeah. Okay, so we killed him, and that was just some after effects there, I think. That was pretty intense. But again, it's nice and dark. I like that. <laughs> it makes it more difficult. Let's bring in a torch. Just look at some of these effects. I like to keep an eye on the effects, folks. Looks really nice. It's good. What time? Okay, 1.44 in game. And now we need to get out of here. Where am I going? Back up, I think. Oh, yeah, I have to go back up to see the girl, don't I? Because she'll talk again, I guess, when I get back up to the top. Um, is it up here? What's going on? Yeah, I think it is. Okay. That should be that then. And we should speak to what's her name? It was a Hannah in a sec, I guess. And she complete the quest. She seems to appear. Maybe she appear at the near the nearer the exit this time. Which way am I going? Which is the exit? I think it's left, isn't it? There she is. Okay. You did it. Yay! Oh, it's nice to be someone's hero. Now I can go be with my mommy and daddy. Here, 
I won't need this anymore, so you can have it. It helps me hide from that bad man sometimes. Ooh, this sounds interesting. A ring of invisibility, maybe, or something like that. I think it's time for me to go now. I'll never forget you. Goodbye. Ta-ta. Right. What did you... Ah, what's this? Oh, 40%. We'll have that. Oh. Lovely. That was another nice little quest, folks. I enjoyed that. I forgot it. I forgot that in quest even existed. Um, have I just gone the right way? I haven't. It's been so long since I played... Uh, where am I going? Oh, shit, man. Come on. Okay. So we just came up. Ah, there it is. Okay. All right. Oh, I've just done it again. Oh, God, man. <laughs> I'm having a bit of a mare. Getting out again, as always. We're going up there, I think, aren't we? Where? Oh. Where's out? Okay. I can't remember. Oh, I might go be going through. Oh, let's have a look. I think that might be it. No, that's the other way. So it must be the opposite then. The opposite thing. Where did I see it? It's not down there, surely. Is is it down there? Let's have a look down there. Yeah, it is. <laughs> okay. I think this is the way out. Looks like it. Yeah, the spiders, that's a spider. Okay, that's good. All right. And again, if you like the stream, folks, hit that like button. I'd appreciate it. Support the series in your own way. I'd appreciate it. Whether it's watching my streams or sharing my work. Donations, if you can afford that. I work full-time on my projects. But again, if you just want to enjoy the streams, that's fair enough too. Because that helps the channel grow as well. <coughs> Excuse me. <coughs> okay, so back to... What's his face? Where is he to? Back here. And it's coming up two hours, and I'm going to finish on the two-hour mark today, folks. No extra plays, because I've got the family here. Um, not right now. Lovely. Time of day. Okay. I'm going to have some lunch. Um, and I'll be continuing this afternoon. I'll be doing more work on the TPS2 series, of course, and the mod pack. And um, I'll be back tomorrow with more streaming. Okay. Nothing new to report. You are doing a great job with these recruits. Keep it up. Great. And she made it back alive, I see. How did she do? Excellent. I've been hoping you would say that. What's next? Hmm. <clears throat> this says some archaeologists had been trying to dig their way into an old buried ruin and woke up all the Draugr in there. The archaeologists said they must have dug up something evil because they ran for their lives. <laughs> <laughs> Take your brother Sorian and see what you find. Okay. Recruit. That was a nice screenshot as well, really. Nice depth of field there. Stand there you tall, go. Soldier. soldier, I fought side by side with your countrymen years ago. You made them and me proud. Dismissed. Sir, thank you, sir. Where am I going? Ah, there we go. Where are we going? We've had some changes in the voting on um, whether E6 will be released before 2033. Yes, it's gone up uh, by a vote or two, I think. No is down to 50%. And not in your lifetime, Nesbitt, is at 
<laughs> okay. I see, I'm not used to the mother of walking corpses when I was a child. They still give me chills to this day. Sounds like fun. Let's go. All right, mate, let's go. Come on. And again, most of these quests are all around Hel Helgen, which is quite nice. So let's think. Let's go to... Let's, why not? Let's go to the Westin Watchtower. And then we'll travel on foot, you know, from there. We just go through to the morning so you can see stuff, folks. Some nice changes going on there, though. And we'll go one more. Just so there's plenty of light. Wow, look at that. Whew. Actually, let's leave that. That looks quite nice. The lights, the sun's just, you know, starting to break over the mountain and through the valley, I guess. We got Greymoor Village there, of course. You will know the mod author, or well, pretty most of you would by now, I suspect. That's nice. Just gonna check this. Lovely, very nice. Okay. Hopefully we'll see some of these new Spriggins that I've loaded up. P Boss's Spriggins. I don't think I got the covered version. I think I got the one with some breasts. So, again, you will see some. Of, I run a couple of P Bosses, folks, just so you know. I run the Hag Ravens in this version, the Vortex Nexus version. I It's Hag Ravens and his um, giants, you know, the, the breasted ones. Um, on the MO2 version, I've installed... The ones that are covered up, so they just got breasts, but they're covered up. But you know, besides UMP, that's about the only sort of adult sort of features that I stick into the game. Besides all the killing and the head chopping and everything else, that is. <laughs> right, we're getting close to, by the looks of it. Um, I think it's just round the corner here. I think, yeah. I think I'm going to go straight in with my sword here. Oh, have I missed it? Ah, oh, bollocks. Oh, we got a dragon. And we got a wolf. Where's the wolf? Okay, sh he dealt with the wolf efficiently. Thank you. Investigate the dig site. It's obviously around here somewhere. Okay. Obviously missed it. Here we go. Oh, here he is. Oh, right. It's right here. Oh, right. Okay. Oh, what's going on? Oh, right. Okay. going on journal right I got going on here folks what am I missing oh it's down here Christ I thought I had an issue there for a minute all right okay that was a little bit confusing okay very dark cave <laughs> all right good stuff
Come on. Just jump. Thank you. Okay, so we're coming up to two hours. Um, I'll do a few, well, I'll do another ten minutes or so, or five minutes, and, and then I'll leave it there. Now, where are we going? Which is the way down? I need some light, actually. It's a bit dark. Okay. I just have some flames on the left. Oh, wrong hand. No, 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 Nesbit. What the fuck are you twat? Come on. Thank you. Okay. Out the way. Here we go. Okay, right. We're going the right way. I think at the moment I'm going to switch to my Berserker. Because the enemies don't seem that challenging. I'll actually stick with the torch as well. What the hell? I'll just save up. No, the torch will burn quickly and I've only got a few of those. I will go to a shield. And again, hit the like button if you like the stream, folks. Share the stream. I'd appreciate it. Oh, trap, trap. Try to avoid that. Thank you. Getting close to our target, I think. Oh, what's going on? There he is. Tight spaces. Yeah, have some of that. <laughs> It's a bit brighter now, a bit more space. Nice. Looking nice. Okay. Looking good. Just gonna try to get an advantage on anything if I can. Sat in where? Somewhere around there. Oh. There's another one, I think. No, that was it. Okay. Are we going down? Or we are going around? Let's have a look. There's a door there. That's not going to be it. No, okay. Not going around. I think we're going down. And. Oh, there's a door over there. I see it. Okay. Let's save. Again, like I say, I don't know what I'm going to come across. Just in case we crash, though we've had no crashes yet. Been a very good um, test since the start, since we started the last um, or the test testing of two T TPS two AE folks. We've had eight streams, and there's been no crashes or anything major, either locally or online. So it's pretty good so far. Touch wood. Okay, where are we going? Oh, we just come up here. Oh, there's got to be a door around here then. What's this? What's all this? We have secret doors, I think, maybe? What's, let's have a torch. I can't see sod all. Ah, there's a bridge. Is this it? I think it is. We're going up. Are we going up or... No, we're not going up. We're going... We're obviously in the right place because I've just triggered something. Are we going up, up, up? Oh, we are. Oh. Die, you piece of shit. Yeah, look at that. Some nice effects as well. Nice depth of field. Love the torches. Um, you know, absolutely love those torches and flames. 
uh, updated to the latest version of XT Embers and um, just up, you know change the patches up as well because there this if you let me just actually caveat this folks if you're using the TPSC mod pack you're using the old version of XT Embers and of course that will load that download that version because it's part of the mod pack but I've just updated XP, XT Embers and there is some update to the patches required for the current version so be aware all right okay through the, oh adept here we go 11 lock pick so i won't be struggling shouldn't be save that <laughs> hack 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 <laughs> what a matey you're following well you're doing your job good stuff this looks nice I like it around here where am I going? That's... Oh, where are we going? This is where we come in, wasn't it? Yeah, that's where we come in. Sure it was, yeah. What am I looking for? This is just a... What at? Okay. So you are going back down. I've got to find another way. Where am I to? Down here. What time is it? Okay, two or two soon. We fi oh, finishing soon, folks. Let's just have a look. Um, is there? Am I going up more, or am I going to be going down? I don't think I'm going up anymore. So I'm going to be going back down, I think, and then. Map. <coughs> Sorry. <coughs> ah, bollocks. Let's just make it brighter so I can see folks and you can see a bit better. And then I might just find out where I'm going. It'd be a bit easier, I guess. Let's just go down and there's something there. What's this? Hold on, what's this down here? This is where we come in, wasn't it? Oh, hold on. There's... Ah, found it. All right, got it. I think I'm going the right way now. I'll leave the brightness up for you. It's going to be, surely that's going to open. Yeah, we're in the right way. We're in the right place, sorry, is what I'm saying. Here we go. Yes, have some of that. Oh. Go large. Oh, this is lovely. This is lovely. Huh. Time for the bow, I think. My instinct tells me. Look at the reflection on the water, folks. That's really that screenshot. Gonna do still gonna do some work on these interiors, but um for a start they're not bad. Is he a dummy or something? Well I expect he's gotta be triggered, isn't he? Alright, we'll play the game.
shit. Lovely jubbly. <laughs> Hello, Nato. Ah, okay, yeah, yeah, yeah. So, you know, be careful with some of your updates. Um, um, in terms of, um, you know, um, TPSC V, I think it's V8 version now. You know, be careful what you update uh, because, like I say, especially anything that's patched, simply because patches, you know, will need to be updated if you're updating a mod that has a lot of patch support, folks. Just be aware of that, all right? Stick with the V8, you know, um, you know, you know in, in some cases, some stuff you'll be able to update. Yeah, but um, I will get back to the V8 version down the line, um, you know, and I'll try to update that. But, yeah, just be aware of that, okay? And thanks for sticking with me, folks, all right? We've been in stream for two hours now, and I've had a good um, audience today, and I, I appreciate that. Thank you. It's, um, it's better than talking to yourself, and I hope you're enjoying what you see. Let's finish off this uh, little area. Oh, what's behind me? Bollocks! Oh. Wow. Where is he? And the reflection in this water and just the look of this game is looking lovely, I think. Any more? Lovely. Take these guys. <laughs> That's a brilliant... Uh, where is he? Excellent. <laughs> Oh, wow, there's a weird collision on that one. They just keep coming. I knew I'd need me bow. Any more? I think that might be it. No, there's more. Jesus, man. Where are they? I thought I just heard more. Okay, so what about this guy? He was just a dummy, look. Okay. Right, so I think we've done everything we need to do there. But I'm just again going to look at the interior. Enjoy the interior. Oh, there is one more. Oh, there he is. Let's take... Oh, oh, look at him. He's a badass. Let's take his head if we can. Boost! Yeah. Love it. Oh, there is some... Um, I haven't seen that before. I don't know if it's the actual cell. But I haven't seen some of the effects we've had... Uh, Nice. Nice lighting, nice effects. Okay, right, let's go. I'll look into that. Are we going through here? Where am I going? How do I get out of here? Oh, it's up there. There it is, all right, okay. All right, so now um, I think we're basically... Are we done here? Okay. We're still exploring the ruins. What time is it? 209 okay all right um i'll keep going for a bit longer depends how much more of this we've got I w if i try to finish this cave folks and then i call it a day all right i'm gonna go and have some food some lunch and relax for a bit before i get on with my afternoon session <laughs> oh shit never saw that Oh, he's dead. All right, he's nothing. Oh, shit, didn't see that. <laughs> Oops. Here we go. Now we're talking. Let's go up, up, up. We're going up a little bit. Lovely. Good stuff. That's the end of you. Now, am I going up or am I going up? Okay. Straddle left, straddle right. And I'll just take a final look at the Poe as well. And so the Poe folks ended up, it's quite amusing that Poe, it made me laugh. So we basically ended up um, with 50% um, no, we're not going to see it before 2033. 33% th think we will, and 17% <laughs> said not in your lifetime, Nesbitt. <laughs> And uh, hit the like button if you like the stream, folks. If you enjoyed the stream today, I'd appreciate that. And uh, we'll just see if we can finish off this, this cave system. Hopefully there isn't much left to do. And then I'll be on my way for the day. But I will be back tomorrow. Just to annoy you for another few hours. <laughs> okay, here we go. Oh, lovely. 
Ah, I got you. You're mine. Lovely. I love the um, bouncing shadow light here. The shadow of the NPC on the walls as I pass the walls. That's oh, what am I doing? What's going on here? Ah, a lever. So that what's that just opened up? Out the way, matey. You're in my way. Get out of my way, moron. God's sake. Where, where, where? Where is it? Must be something right. Ah, oh, it's opened up this gate, I think. I imagine that's... Oh, no, that's where we come up. Don't be a fool, Nesbitt. What's it opened? What's... The, I need a tour. Is it opened here? It might have opened up this, I think. Is, it, is this what's been opened up? Looks like it might be. Map. Yeah, it is. And we're going the right way. Okay. Lovely jubbly. I th oh, I think we're almost there. <laughs> Let's have some flames. Because that's just really effective. And it looks so good on the interiors, folks. And you see... And I did I did brighten up the interior lighting for you. I'm just going to drop that down now. A fraction, I think. To where I like it to be. There, look. Here we go. No, he's already dead, I think. Actually, it's a bit dark. I better put it back up, just so you can see. Where are they? Oh, they're from above. You shitheads! Have some of that. Have some of that. Who's the man? <laughs> How do I get up there? Where am I going? That's all blocked off, I think. Ah, oh, we're going up. Okay. Am I going the right way? I'm not sure. That's a dead end. It's over there by the looks of it. Okay. Oh, that's good. Oh, look at this. Oh, that was easy. Okay, thank you. Okay, save. We're almost set. Complete. Explore the ruins. Uh, find the claw that unlocks the gate. Ah, oh, shit. Oh, balls, man. Where's the claw? So I've got to find the claw that unlocks the gate. Where is it? Do I, oh, bot, are you joking me? Ah, bollocks. All right, folks, in that case, then, um, I think I'll come back tomorrow. I'll leave that there, okay? Um, we'll find the claw tomorrow. We'll continue the quest tomorrow, okay? Um... Because this is going to go on for a bit longer than I thought. I'm just going to come out and give my thanks to you all. I always like to do that. I just think that's a, a nice thing to do. So, we're going to end the poll. The poll ends as it does. So, thanks for the interaction there. That was uh, fun. I, I, I've create, <coughs> sorry, <coughs> I'll create a new poll tomorrow. So, NATO, Jack, Nut. Um, who else have we got here? Why is it not scrolling up? There is more comments than that, isn't there? Oh, it might have fixed. I can't seem to up, scroll up. Anyway, let me just say to anyone that's joined the stream today, the stream today, sorry, everyone that's joined it, for your likes, um, for your interaction, for all you do, folks, I appreciate it. It's been a good, it's been good fun. Um, I forgot how much fun Helgen Reborn is. It's a very, very good mod. Um, and so far, it's working really well. We've had very few issues. And those issues we have had are not related to Helgen Reborn. They're related to the, just, you know, the crossing over with other mods, so some patchwork need to be done and some other stuff. And that will be done at the end of my assess assessment. So um, take care, NATO. Thanks for joining me. And I will just finish off by saying, folks, you know, if you support TPOS, the TPOS series in your own way, I'd appreciate it, whether it's watching the streams, likes, donations, whatever you can do, I'd appreciate it. And for all of you that have and do support the work, thanks so much. I'm Nesbit. You're the people of Skyrim. Good gaming, folks. I'll see you tomorrow, 11.45 GMT. Take care.